That's what I was oh, going to. Oh, these are dope. Yeah. And right. they like my favorite color. <laughs> oh. Did you know that? Nah. Oh. Uh, <laughs> I was actually, I, I was. Oh, pre thank you so, I'm sorry, sir. <laughs> <laughs> oh, these are awesome. All right, they. I love flowers, um, thank you. It's definitely, it's, I remember that Nimeri Poppins um she was the 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 initiator she just like she's like okay uh what uh yeah so she said get flowers from me. yeah mary and poppins thank you that I makes did. me feel so good like i love flowers i love all kinds of flowers but those are like my favorite color <laughs> thank you thank you thank you thank you thank you and it was told to me that when someone gives you roses that it is a blessing it is a blessing and that God is watching so I appreciate that that, that really means a lot to me so wow <laughs> I did not expect that <laughs> and we started listening to a song i'm trying to remember what I song forgot was the it. song it was yeah and but i okay i think we should start with that song right so we can kind of you remember it sort of yeah i mean i remember the artist and and i connected it to the big speaker so it should be good okay so we are just gonna we're just gonna finish that song then we'll start listening in the car i do remember like how it made me feel though because i was like oh this is a cool song like no, this not this. No, no, that's not it. That's not it. It was like uh, I can't really remember, but I just remember. There was I remember the guitar when it started with the, the, the guitar was playing. Oh yeah, no, that's what the song. That's what the song actually. That was it. Yeah. I feel like I had a different. Well, well, yeah. The beginning, I think it was, it might have been too repetitive for me. Like it was good. It was very, you know, uh, I'm not busy. Very, um, oh my goodness. Boppy. Like it just gave me, like it had a really good bop. I don't know. After like the first half of it, I was kind of like, oh, all right. Like my mind just started yeah. drifting. Yeah. 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 But it wasn't bad. It definitely wasn't a bad song. Um, definitely a song to get you moving. Yeah, and again, the only reason why we, why I played this song because when we were in the car, I was right. like, I, I had no idea what we was going to listen, so I just like, randomly yeah, yeah, no. Russian song. But I feel like when the car, yeah. it just hit different. Yeah. <laughs> again, you see how probably the environment also affects you and that, how you that uh, is true. Per perceive the song. I mean, you know. That is and very true. Like in the car, you, you're driving, you, you have different kind of like perception when you listen to a song. I didn't think or about it like that. You are, again, I'm not even talking up. I'm going to put aside the mood, mm -hmm. you know. Though, again, I think the mood also can be created by the environment. That is true. 
It can be. The mood can be created by and the And this is, I think, the perfect example, though we didn't really have a chance to fully listen to the song in the car, but still you, you, you was thinking about something else. Yeah. I mean, it didn't pretty much change. I mean, nothing was just like, it stayed pretty much the same. No, I'm, I mean, but yeah. it does. If you yeah. think about it, you're in the car, it was nice out that day, we were driving, yeah. so it's just like, it's, yeah. being outside does put you in a different mood yeah. too. So, I didn't think about it like that, but. Yeah, so it was it was good. Like the the beat, the music, the the trumpets, the it reminds me of uh, some Latin music. Yeah, it probably me, that's what he did because they, they, they did those screams and mm -hmm. uh, you know they just yeah, give me like this Latin feel. Like you just wanna yeah. I never liked the artist when I was a kid because he was considered to be a girl, you know, for girl art, right? A, a singer um, for like, girls. Yeah. Much later. I kind of, you know, went through his songs, through his discography, mm -hmm. and I was like, okay, he has some nice songs. Yeah. This one, what is funny, there is another thing that I kind of noticed. People in the comments be like, yo, you, you play a lot, of, a lot of good bands, but you don't play their hits. Mm -hmm. And that's probably one of the problems with me, because in most cases, I don't like hits. I don't know why, I mean, you know, it's, just like what is considered, like not every time, of course, right. but it's it, it's very uh, it's very often when when I when I when I realize that, okay, this is this band's hit, but it's not my favorite, and then but I like some other you know there are other song which is, I I, I don't I, I don't want to say underrated but it doesn't have a lot of attention, but it's like my favorite. Um, sometimes with hits. I feel like they're forced on you. So to someone like yourself or even myself, songs that you constantly are forced to listen to, you kind of get turned off from. And it's like, it's not a bad song. It's not that I don't want it, but what else does the artist have to offer? You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Like radio forces it or TV, like that. So, cause I don't, a lot of, a lot of stuff that's even on the radio now or like those big hits yeah. are not my favorite songs. And you know how I already had a conversation with somebody many years ago when I was I was talking about all this popular like mainstream music right, right, that right. like people be like why 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 somebody listen to the you know to this kind of music but then I was like yo put yourself in a situation like when you are surrounded by you know media radio exactly. TV and for, at first you'd be like oh what kind of sh whack song it is you know then the second time you listen to it, it was like okay third time you already start bopping to it you know so it's just kind of yeah, they, they just gotta kinda, get used they, to they, it it's kind of it kind of wears on you you know that's true and, that's very true and and that's why people don't really realize how to get involved into it they start liking this song they don't realize right. like oh that's not, actually the song is not is not bad you know and it happened to me too you know sometimes it'd be like oh man whoa that song is awful but then you hear it more and more, especially when you don't play, but mm -hmm. somebody plays it for you when you hear it somewhere else. Right. That's true. You know, yeah. And me. this is definitely that not was a, the, Yeah, it was just one of them. It was like, it was all right. It yeah. wasn't, yeah. I couldn't even catch it, like to even think about what it meant. I was more focused on how it made me feel. Just to keep it short, I mean, so. it's like he's talking about like a regular average dude. Average Joe, uh, who cannot, okay. who who cannot dream. Hey. Well, I mean, he can dream probably, but who right. cannot get a, a star like girl. Oh. You know. So, so he dreams of he he dreams of her, but he probably can't yeah, he get it. He said like those kind of girls, you know, never gonna be available for right. him. You know, so. No, I get it. <laughs> so yeah, that was. Our yeah, that episode. was all right. Yeah, who was, was that again? It was. Andre Gubin. Andre Gubin.